Welcome to the Quilting Bee. Who's here anyway? Let's see. Um, a particular quilt that I've always wanted to do, that I uh, might like to do next. I like them all. Uh, maybe. <laughs> Maybe drunkard's path. Maybe drunkard's, drunkard's path. 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 That might be fun. Pink Sally wants to know if I've made any art books. Those I only do those when I'm traveling. Of course, now that traveling may be a thing of the past, maybe I should dream up something for now. Actually, one time uh, when I had a trip all planned, at the very last minute something came up and I couldn't go. So I decided I would take a trip to San Francisco, where I live. So I did everything exactly the same. I usually go for places for at least a month. So I made plans that I would be gone for a month. I sent letters to um, lots of my friends who lived in San Francisco and said I was coming kind of hoping somebody would invite me to uh, uh, stay at their place for a couple of days. Nobody went quite that far, but people did offer to uh, take me uh, out to see the city, um, to take me out for dinner, a fancy place or something. Um, and uh, it was pretty exciting, and then I decided to make a travel book on this this trip to San Francisco. So I couldn't, while I was here, uh, I tried to act the way I do when I'm someplace else. Oh, I went lots of places. I went to the museums. I actually miss shows here because it's too easy to get to them. Um, I went out for dinner. I did the things I do when I'm traveling, and there were all kinds of things I couldn't do. So that, that was fun. Anyway, how did I get onto that subject? That's the thing about quilting bees. Uh, your mind can just sort of wonder. Um, and uh, Linda, hi Linda, <laughs> you're back. Um, it, what, uh, asking about the Bali quilt. You know, that that's the quilt that got stolen. And uh, you want to know uh, if it was ever recovered. Yes, it was. Uh, it was very interesting. That, that quilt was stolen uh, out of the uh, offices of a doctor where it was hanging in the room right before the reception room. It was a more of a common room uh, in a fancy area in Palo Alto. Uh, and uh, he came to work one morning and it was gone. And we got very excited about it. I felt terrible because I thought it was one of my best quilts. And uh, of course he was uh, very upset at losing it. And uh, we did all kinds of things. You know, there's actually a, a place online where you can, uh, announce if a quilt has gone missing, either been lost or uh, stolen, and uh, they'll try to track it down for you. Sort of like a lost pet. And also the strangest question you asked, have I ever made cloth dolls? 
No. I have a friend that does doll-like things. I mean, they have appendages and things and they're, they're cloth, but no. It's just something that uh, didn't come up on my list of things I was dying to do.